Your birthday swarm. Oh, birthday bees. <laughs> birthday bees. <laughs> Did it come out of the white box? Yeah. Yeah, so we got a swarm of bees that came out of this white box over here and landed over here. This is honeysuckle. Or what is it? It's just a tree with honeysuckle vines. Oh, on it. gotcha. So they rested right here, which is good. <laughs> yep. At least it wasn't, you know, up there or something. Yeah. Way up there. Yeah. <laughs> to shoot them out. <laughs> or, um, you know, they, they landed in here the last time, but all this was really grown up and yeah. and stuff, so it was hard to get to them. We there did was a one video. time I helped my grandpa, and they were that high, you know, 40 feet. <laughs> we borrowed a, I think he brought his tractor down here with the front end loader. Oh gosh. And lifted me up in it. Oh my word. And, was, and I had to reach way up here, and they just fell all over me when I shook them off. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Does that sound like fun, Sydney? <laughs> you don't think you want to be a beekeeper? No, I don't like bees. Yeah. Well, I do like honey. Yeah. Oh my gosh, a bee already went in it. Already did what? A bee went in it. He did. Yeah, there's, yeah, there's well, bees coming around. around. Yeah. So you already put some lemongrass oil or something, something else? I put some in some different boxes down there. Oh. You don't have to put it in this. Once gotcha. the queen's in there, gotcha. So you're just at home. So just shaking them in there and hoping yeah. the queen goes with them is what keeps them in there. Yeah, because she'll start laying immediately, okay. and they'll stay. Gotcha. Usually, they could leave. They're flying around me too much. This is going to be pretty easy. This does not look easy to me at all. Is it you? No, I'm pretty scared. <laughs> We're standing way far away. Yep. Yep. Are you ready? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Jerry. Whew. Oh, they're coming closer.
<laughs> Good job. That's what they do. They were, I mean, they were exploding when I put that extra box on there. Yeah. They, they could, I just should have put two boxes on it. I took, last winter I took like three hives that were not doing very good and put them all together into one hive. Oh. That's why they're doing so well. Well. It's better to have one live one than four dead ones. Yeah. Now you got another now one. Now we got two live ones. Yeah. So why do people not want swarms? Like, didn't your grandparents well, not want like weren't they fr afraid of their bees swarming and well if you can stop them if you can prevent them from swarming they will make more honey because okay. you just got to imagine two-thirds of the bees are over here now right and that one doesn't have a queen so they're already three weeks behind on getting population built up yeah and it takes three weeks to get after a bee's born i think it's three weeks or something like that before they start flying out to to gather nectar. So by them swarming, they're six weeks behind now. Gotcha. Usually this one will outdo that one. A swarm, the new one. since it's their natural tendency to swarm, they will be very productive because they know they got to do all they can do to survive through the winter. So usually they'll fill out one of those frames with new comb. They'll fill out three or four in like two days hmm. or less. <coughs> I just need to check on tomorrow. Get yeah. Did you get stung any? No, swarms are swarms are easy to yeah. manage. Good. I'm glad that was a pretty easy one. Yep. <laughs>